started on March 2nd when Christina Barber's co-workers called and said she didn't show up to work for a week and wasn't answering her phone. After an investigation, Genesee Township Police arrested 34-year-old Christopher Motri and the prosecutor's office have filed charges. Motri, and only Motri, comes out with what appears to be a body in a plastic bag in a fireman's carry and puts it into the bed of his truck. You never see Ms. Barber again. Genesee County Prosecutor David Layton says Christopher Motri is seen in surveillance video leaving the Flint Motel at 8 p.m. on February 29th. Layton says Barber and Motri met when they worked together at a Burger King. And Ms. Barber was trying to get out of that affair according to the interviews that Genesee Township Police conducted with co-workers and Mr. Motri was not necessarily being cooperative about that. And I'm, I'm obviously putting it very lightly here. Layton says Barbara was divorced, but Motri is married. Genesee Township Police say when they went to the motel room to investigate on March 3rd, there was a lot of blood found inside that room. There was also a blood-stained mattress and kitty litter on top of that blood-stained mattress. And there was kitty litter on the floor just to the left of the bed where the mattress likely had been. On March 4th, a fisherman called 911. And that he had found a garbage bag, a black garbage bag, with what appeared to be toes from a person sticking out of the bag. Police say the distance from the Flint Motel to where the body was found is about two to two and a half miles. It was on the banks of the river, so it just was a matter of time before somebody came along to that spot and discovered that body. Motri now faces a first-degree murder charge and would get a mandatory life sentence if he's found guilty. He's due back in court on March 21st. Layton says Christina Barber had children and some have been in touch with investigators. Live in the studio, Courtney Bennett in Michigan Now.